flooding due to rising sea levels could actually be worse in the U.S. than previously thought. So not only is water rising, but major coastal cities are also sinking. This according to a new study, and that includes San Francisco as well as other Bay Area cities. ABC 7 News reporter Suzanne Fawn spoke with the experts. San Francisco is one of several local cities sinking into the ground, according to new research. And that, mixed with rising sea levels, could make flooding even worse in the coming decades. The new information comes from a paper published in Nature that studied subsidence, or sinking in 32 coastal cities, including San Francisco, South San Francisco, Oakland, Richmond, Foster City, and Santa Cruz. Subsidence is part of the problem, but for the Bay Area, what's unique to us is our triple whammy of sea level rise, rising groundwater, and lowland flooding from more extreme storms. Werner Chabot is with the San Francisco Estuary Institute, an environmental science research institute focused on the Bay and the Delta. The Bay Area is ground zero for climate change and sea level rise. Um, we're literally 8 million people living in a bathtub. The report said it's too late for mitigation efforts, so we need to adapt. Efforts are underway to control flooding in the future. Foster City is improving its levees. And in San Francisco, there's a plan to elevate the ferry building and most of the Embarcadero seven feet into the air. But that plan, introduced back in January, would need approval from Congress. Our future depends on taking action now. This is why the draft plan is so critical to protecting the city's seawall from earthquake and flooding risks. It's going to be a big price tag. It's going to cost a lot to make all the suggested improvements across the Bay Area. The cost over the next 25 years to prevent lowland flooding by the year 2050 is about $110 billion of infrastructure improvements we're going to have to make. But not doing anything could be even more costly in the long run. The estimated price tag? About $230 billion in estimated damages and repairs that would have to be done. There's a tremendous amount of planning being done at the city, county, and regional level right now, and there will be an intensive amount of, of work done over the next couple of years. In San Francisco, Suzanne Fawn, ABC 7 News.